This is this is the picture I missed yeah. by the time I pulled out my phone. So today on What's Up Guy Garage, Mrs. What's Up Guy Garage is actually going to drive no, no. the new Max. No, no, no. no. I'm just, <laughs> yes, you are. I'm just she filming. thinks she's just here for filming, but actually she's here to actually drive it for its first outing. So it's sitting right there, hasn't had one battery placed through it, and guess what? I get to drive it? Yes, you do. <laughs> All right, so what we're going to do is we're actually going to run the Max on a 2S cell pack right now. And this pack actually doesn't fit exactly how Traxxas is kind of intending it fit to fit. But guess what? It actually fits at a side arc, which I don't know if you can see that. See how it's fitting the side right there? And then obviously when you clamp over the, when you unlock it or lock it into place, it actually will stay in. So you can see right there, battery pack doesn't really fit the width. And that's one of the typical things of Traxxas is Traxxas likes to try to guide you to, I guess, their proprietary, you know, things, systems, whatever. But there's always ways around things, so. Anticipating? Yeah. <laughs> we're going to be taking this thing out, so we're going to slap on the top. So on these Traxxas, you know, X-Max and Max vehicles, they have the clip system, which this actually kind of clips basically under the shock towers or in between the shock towers. And then there's the lock uh, little pin or locking system that actually clamps down and locks to the side. And it tries to keep the top on. We'll switch the remote on first, which you can see, green light, the remote's on. Then we'll switch the truck on, and there's actually, if you want to zoom in here, there's actually a start button right there or an on and off button. You can just press and hold the button, and boom. It's all set, ready to go. You can hear the fan going. You can see the LED lights. We're ready to go. So let's put the top on. And I'm gonna take a hold of the camera because guess what? Like I said, she's the one driving this thing. So we found, we found a nice spot which is underneath the bridge. And we came across some nice leaves and, and I think we're gonna get some nice footage with this Max going out for its first run and misses What's Up Guy Garage. She's the one that's actually going to be driving it. Is it already going forward? <laughs> now you want to be able to... Yeah, there you go. She's literally already ripping it. I mean, like I can hear the thing. The thing is like flying. I think she's doing like donuts. You should see her smile. So like you're doing some donuts, honey. <laughs> Look at her smile. Look at this. Look at the donuts. She's just doing donuts with it. <laughs> now, how much trigger do you have pulled when you were just doing that? Very little, very little like what, quarter? Yeah, She's very intently watching it. So I'm actually going to set the camera up here and let her just do some driving.
y'all. You got it. Have you figured out the reverse yet? There you go. It's just what it does. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <-hoo -hoo. laughs> that was awesome. Do you want to come closer so you know where the camera is? I was just going to say, because we have a camera set up right here. Facing that way. Likes a donut. controlling it. <laughs> You're doing awesome. Woo! Hey! So, I don't know if on 3S if it's going to do it, but there is supposedly a self-writing feature. That is what it's made for. It's made for that. Don't worry about it. What? It does smell nasty though. <laughs> so we're back. 2S battery is fully expended. So what'd you think? It's fine. So now what she's going to do is she's going to demonstrate how to pull out the new battery or how to pull out the 2S battery that's in there. So she's going to turn that little clip counterclockwise, then you flip back the latch, and then you basically just kind of hold on to the front bumper and then pull back on the on the body. Just rock it, pull it back. There you go. And now she's going to shut off the truck, which is that little blue button that's right there. Push it? Yep. Push it. Good. Now what you need to do is on this on this style of battery uh, retainer, you want to basically push the, the, these tabs forward, like push the battery piece forward, like towards the end part of the truck. It's a little difficult. Just push it forward. There you go. Now you lift it up. So lift up. This? Yep. Oh. Now you disconnect this little connector. Is it just pulled? Yep, Which so part? this part will disconnect from that yellow part. There you go. Now just go ahead and pull out the battery. And now you can see we actually went through a bunch of water. So what she's going to do 
She's actually gonna just take the truck and she's gonna dump it upside down. So we're gonna go ahead and throw another 2S battery in it. You don't have to clean it out? We're just gonna dump it out. I just did. So it's all dumped out, so we're ready to go. Yeah, if you wanna clean leaves out of it, that's fine. But yeah, you just get, you know, the contaminants, the water and stuff out of there. You can use a paper towel if you want, it's up to you. Safety first with those lipos. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and grab another 2S lipo to throw in the truck so that she can get another speed run. So you can see right there, it's a 2S lipo. So now this one doesn't have a connector on it. It has actually the TRX connector, which is the Traxxas. Sweet. So she's gonna go ahead and she's gonna try and fit that in, plug it in after. So you saw that it was kinda, of, kinda of came in kind of at an arc. Now we've never fit one of these 2S batteries in it. 3S. So this is going here? Yeah, but we, what you have to do is you actually have to take this little connector out. Yep, because that's an adapter. So this is what's called, so this is what's called an XT90 to TRX connector or Traxxas connector, all right? So we're gonna throw that up there for now. And instead of connecting it up first, you want to make sure that this can actually lock down on the new battery. Does it look like it can? Is that it? Nope. Remember how you had to click it? So now you want to make sure it's down and push it back. Okay. So you want to click it back. Remember, push it down, click it back, push it down. Click it back with your thumbs that way. There you go. All clipped in. Now you can go ahead and plug in the, the Traxxas connector. It only plugs in one way, so if it doesn't plug in that way, just spin it around. Make sure, yep, fully seated. Now go ahead and turn the remote back on, unless it's still on. It's still remote's on. Remote's still on, that's fine. No on. big deal. Perfect. Now go ahead and turn the truck back on. Now let's put the top back on. So this is gonna be her first experience putting the top back on. You actually don't have to worry about the wires, plenty of room underneath the body of the truck. So this is her first time throwing this body on by herself. So look at underneath, right? See underneath, see how it has that little connector? That needs to go under here. Oh. So it's kind of like push down on it and push forward. There you go, perfect. Now make sure that this latches up. And then flip it down, turn it clockwise until it locks in. May have to kind of just push it down a little bit more. Perfect. All right. So now she's going to take it on another blast with that uh, 2S, 3S battery. Ready to go, babe? The other way. She's trying to put it. She's, I guess she's trying to pack it away already. Sorry. <laughs> don't be sorry. And be careful. Don't kick up the rocks. She actually has no idea that it's in 3S right now. It should be a little faster. I wonder if she'll notice. Don't be afraid to goose it. Give it some, give it some speed. Let's see what this thing's got. Okay, do a speed run. Brakes! I know, but it, it's, <laughs> it's like if you don't step on the brake on the car, they'll do the same thing. I didn't know that. I didn't... <laughs> Did you think that it was actually going to stop by itself? Yes. No, ah! it's not going to stop by itself. Yeah, press on the brake, it's forward. There you go. What was that? What'd you just say? <laughs> it's <been> a... <laughs> Look at 
good. You had it. You were good. What's the matter? What was that? Nice little wheelie. Boy, she's getting real good at turning that thing around. That's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to get dirty, honey. Do some speed runs, let's go. See what this thing's got. <gasps> Remember the brake. <laughs> what was it? <laughs> you forgot the brake? What? Didn't flip it? It was pretty much at this moment that I should have rethought my idea. Whoa. Whoa. Well, it wasn't exactly what I was wanting to do. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> so, how would you rate the experience? A 10. A 10? Except for the fact that what you, happened? You. You broke your phone. You smashed your phone. <laughs> so, and it was horrible to watch uh, and do nothing about it. I know. There's sometimes there's nothing you can do. And am I happy about destroying the phone? No, but we'll figure something out. It's no big deal. It's just a screen <laughs> on a Note 8 again. So, yeah, I know again. <laughs> but anyways, that's how powerful the Max is because, you know, when the Max is running, I mean, get out of the way. And, um... Did no, you, did, you don't put the phone in the way. I know, but it's all to catch footage, you know what I mean? Sometimes you have I to... I could have held it. I could have held it. I know, it. she's right. She could have held, held it, held but it. I was trying to get one of those low-down shots, and it just didn't work out. No. But it is what it is. So right now what she's going to do what? is she's going to show you the process of how now you put away the truck because it's actually still running right now. You can hear the fan going, and... She's just going to go through those steps. So obviously you want to make sure that you leave the remote on. Oh. Yeah, turn that little key, flip back the latch, <laughs> and not have the remote like within your foot distance. <laughs> Pull back. Just rip it back. There you go. Good. Now go ahead and shut it off. Press and hold the button to shut it off. There you go. Good. So now what we want to do is go ahead and turn off the remote. Awesome. And now we're going to disconnect the battery because you don't want to leave a LiPo battery connected. And we're actually going to take it out of the truck. What, the battery? Yep, so we're going to go ahead and show you okay. show you how to take that battery out. Does it lift up? No, nope. remember I have push. to push it forward. No. 
lift up. Yep, and then just go ahead and ooh, the battery got really in there. Nice. Okay. Cool. So we'll just go ahead and put the battery in here for now. Look at that. She wants to keep it clean. And I'll go ahead and shut the remote off. I did shut oh, it, it off. Oh, it is off. Wow. You told me to shut it off. You're way ahead of me. Okay. Perfect. Put the remote in there. Put all the other stuff in there just for now. This is the adapter thing. The adapter. Thank you. How are you guys clean? Ah, just let it air dry. Can kind of actually, you know what? If you want to hold the camera. I'll just kind of bang it out. So, here we go. Now it is a used Max. So, once we get this thing home, actually be able to clean it a little bit better than, you know, kind of just open, blowing on it because that doesn't do anything. And see, now it really is definitely... I can't see the screen anymore. Tap it. See? Oh, yes. There we go. <laughs> so... Yeah, so that was actually the first bash with the Max, and the first person to actually use the Max? Me! Yeah, and you really did like it? Yes, honey. So, so this is cool. Hopefully this is gonna turn into a... Uh, occasional. Mr. and Mrs. Occasional. What's, up, what's Up Guy Garage occasional. Yeah, well, we're gonna have some fun. Um, we got the whole Bayo Hyper MT, which is, you know, obviously my truck right there, and then this Max right here, pretty much can be her truck. And I mean, obviously I'll ask her if I can borrow it. But <laughs> yes. <laughs> but uh, yeah, just expect more footage from What's Up Guy Garage and bashing the Max. Thanks for watching. There we go. Look at all the beautiful little fractures that we've got all over this phone now. This is probably the worst that I've ever cracked a screen. It got a nice bash down there, but the reason why I replaced the other one was because up in this corner where the sensors and everything was, that's where that phone got destroyed. But this one's got that nice, you know, I don't know, it's got that cool broken glass look. So as I'm driving this Max around, what I'm noticing is it's got an extremely tight, I guess you want to say turning radius. And then obviously with controlled braking, you can literally get this thing to turn on what they call a dime. Well, actually, is there anything smaller than a dime? Because that thing literally almost turns over back on itself. It like literally just does one of those mechano wheel like turnarounds. And I can't get the actual footage for it. I don't feel like destroying this camera. You know what I mean? Why the, the leaves on the trees are beautiful. They're all coming down. Oh no. I didn't tell me to stop the court. But did I stop?